Tonight on Steel Valley Vintage, something a little bit different. Downtown Youngstown, Ohio, it's Stambaugh Auditorium, opened 1926. Money given by local businessman Henry Stambaugh. We're here to see Tony Hawk, pro skateboarder, Bones Brigade, 1980s, businessman, entrepreneur, Tony Hawk pro skater video game, and more. We'll go inside see what he has to say. Hopefully we can add some more footage of Tony Hawk in Youngstown, Ohio at Stambaugh Auditorium. Entering the auditorium, Stambaugh, right outside of Youngstown State University, Youngstown, Ohio. Youngstown State University presents Tony Hawk tonight on this stage. Was, was actually pretty good considering they didn't even skate the developers. And 
I signed on right away. I said, yeah, I would love to work with this. This is amazing. And, and with my resources and with my outreach, I can probably get this to a place where it's much more authentic. Um, and and skaters will want it. And to me, the market of success for the video game was going to be that skateboarders wanted to buy a PlayStation. That was it. To me, like, that, that's, that's the end goal. And yes, I did it. Skaters like to skate. So thank you very much. Okay, Steel Dollar Vintage walking out of the event with Tony Hawk in Youngstown, Ohio. Great speaker, told some great stories from his youth growing up in the skateboard community with the Bones Brigade, working with Stacy Peralta, all the way up through the amateur and pro competitions. And of course, the video game, Birdhouse Skateboards, video game with Activision was a really cool story. We have a clip of that earlier there for you. One of the coolest things happened at the end of the event in the question and answer section. I didn't get video of it, but there is a skateboarder I believe named Chris Weddle, and they named a trick after him without his permission way back in the 1980s, the mute grab. And a young man from the crowd who was deaf asked the question about how Tony Hawk got and was a part of getting that name to change. And that name now, Tony Hawk helped get change into the Weddle grab. So I thought that was a pretty cool story there at the end of the event. Hope you enjoyed seeing Tony Hawk on Steel Valley Vintage in Youngstown, Ohio. Let's see if I can get a shot of downtown here from the top steps of the Stambaugh Auditorium. Once again, Tony Hawk, Steel Valley Vintage, overlooking YSU's campus. Have a great night.